All right, guys, and welcome back. We're going to be doing something a little bit different today. Now, this is very, very different to what I normally put on, on this channel, um, but this is a game called Erica. It's a interactive game. Your choices determine the outcome and the ultimate ending, but it's full motion video. There's no graphic overlay. There's no, there's no graphics at all. This is all completely acted and voiced by real people. Um, and you've, you've, you basically got to pick choices as you progress through the game. And, well, I just want to see what it's all about. It was released just under a year ago. Um, but it was recently allowed... Well, it was recently given to us free by, by PlayStation for the month of July. So, sorry, it's a little bit late for you to pick it up yourselves. Though it is a cheap game. So, if you do like this, then go ahead, get it yourself, and see if you come up with a different ending to me. I'll probably do this in a couple of parts because um, I think it's a couple of hours long, but we'll we'll get started now. Let's let's okay. So you've got a choice. You can actually use a smartphone uh, and download the Erica app PS4, which apparently is a little bit easier. But I'm going to struggle through with the controller and just see if I can I can do it this way. Well, welcome to uh, a brand new game. Let's give it a go. So you've got to use the touchpad on your controller, which isn't the 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 easiest to use, especially if you've got uh, control freaks attached to your thumb no thumbsticks as I have. Uh, okay, so for accessibility, subtitles and other options, pause the game by pressing options. Got it. Can I do that now? No, this is an interactive story. Choices form one of many perspectives. No single path holds all the answers. Okay, so they're encouraging you to replay if you want to find out everything about the game. Okay. So, we are presented with a lighter. Let me very quickly just switch on the subtitles. And then we will resume. Okay. Uh, okay, I've got a lighter, I suppose I have to. Yep, I've got to flip, flip it open. And all of this is controlled with the touchpad there. So, I had to swipe up and, yeah, anyway. Let's give this thing a light. Tip it down. This is making a lot of sense. Okay. All good so far. We've mastered the control system. What do I do with it? Oh, okay. Giving, giving it a turn which doesn't seem to be doing anything. Oh, yeah. Okay. Got it. We have to stroke it. <laughs> That's what she said. Sorry, not, not the right thing to say at this moment in time. Drag to explore. Oh, what do we have here? A music box. And, oh, yeah, you can... <laughs> These controls are weird. Never played a game or just purely using the touchpad before. Things only she could see. Okay. I tell her about the past. About a great priestess marked with a butterfly who could stare into the fire and see the future. I used to tell her she was magic, just like the priestess. I think you're magic too. But you're going to have to prove it. 
pick a photograph. Pick oh. Pick my favorite photograph. Uh, how about the one on the right? The beginning of... The beginning of life. Uh, oh my god, okay, I can make it... This is like Harry Potter. Moving pictures. Focus your mind. And conjure the power of the ancient priestess. Now find your mom again. See if you can guess where your favorite is. Oh, great. Uh, turn left, turn right, or turn middle. What should we go for? Um, it was on the right-hand side the first time. So let's try the left. Oh, it wasn't. Okay, I failed. I'm not a priestess. Oh, disaster. Disaster? Really? I still think you're magic. She'll always be with you. Remember that. Even though she isn't here, she's still a part of you. There you go, I failed my first magic test. If you could stare into the fire and see the future, what do you think you'd see? Okay, a creepy door. This is this is not this is not I don't like creepy doors. Oh god. Oh, I don't want to touch I don't want to touch that. Did he die because I failed the picture test? <laughs> what the? Oh, oh, okay, that's a strange thing to have um, on your chest. Some kind of symbol. Oh, I've got to, I've got to explore this, really? Can I put my finger in the, can I put my finger in the gun? Okay, that looks like complete flashback. Was it a flashback? Was it a dream? I guess we'll find out more as we progress. It's, it's funny, although this is captured video, you know, it's done in a way that it f almost feels like it's... A g oh, look at this. You can actually <laughs> wipe out the, the mist on the mirror. It actually feels like it's uh, a game, you know, because the overlays... I've got to completely defog this thing. Okay. All oh, right. I have choices. Let go, face it, reassure, or justify. Um, what the, the horrors that she just dreamed? We we need to we need to let them go. I do. Okay, I was doing the right thing. It's fine. I can I can move my eyes around, but I can't really change what I'm seeing here. Oh God. Okay. Was she throwing up in the? I can't tell if that she was throwing up or coughing. Secure lock or unlock. Uh oh, I see. Um, let's secure it. Yeah. 
Help or complain? Oh, I should say I should offer some help. Come on, she might not be a bad person. I can't actually do it. Why can't I do it? Are you okay? Oh god, I've got to. I can't forget. I've got to take part in this. <laughs> oh right, okay. What do we got here? Some very spooky drawings. It really does feel like a game, though. You know, just the shots, the certain, the choices, the the the. Sorry, the the shot choices that they're making. It, it's it's. I'm having a hard time believing it isn't a game at the moment. Uh, well, it's an interactive game, isn't it? Who's this? That's my father with somebody on the on the right hand side. Oh yep, yeah, that's the, the man with the knife and the gun. Music player. And that'll be the nurse. The picture that I I failed. I don't know if that was if everybody fails when they take that choice. Okay. I just signed my name there. That's my signature, just an X. Oh, this is the symbol she saw on her dad's... Carved into her dad's chest. What have I got to do? Oh, okay. Keep going over it. <laughs> never, never going to be good. A parcel you weren't expecting. Marked fragile. Oh god, there's blood coming out of the corner. Oh, oh god, I don't want to look. What is this going to be? It's going to be somebody's testicles or something. Oh, right, okay. Could have been worse. <laughs> Certainly what I was thinking. And the, uh, whatever was it, the hand was holding. Same symbol, yep. I'm Sergeant Blake. The lead investigator on this case. Can I see that? I promise I'll give it back. So he's investigating the... I'll rip it out or hand it over. I'll just hand it over. It's fine. Investigating my father's murder. I draw this a lot. It's Greek, isn't it? In Delphic Epsilon. Oh, right. Yeah, totally knew that. Question or be cooperative? Um, well, there's policemen in the background. I think I should be cooperative. I understand them Italian, too. The hand belonged to a Cal Jahar. He worked at Delphi House. I believe you visited there with your father. Uh, why, why is that relevant? Links to the case. Well, it's the guy's hand. Of course, it's relevant. Uh, links to the case. This is about my father. Your father's case was never solved. I'm pretty sure there's a connection. Did you know he co-founded Delphi House with this man, Lucian Flowers? We think Mr. Flowers might be a target, too. Look, we're keeping watch over at Delphi House. Protection detail. I'll be leading the investigation from there. Right now, it's the safest place for you, too. Lucian Flowers. Saying that's the same guy. See, it's not a parcel you'd expect to receive every day. Severed hand. I forget the name of the guy that sh they said it was attached to, formerly attached to.
But obviously it's something to do with me, otherwise they wouldn't have sent me the hand, would they? Uh, oh, look at this. Oh, I think we're going back in time again. That's her father. And this was the the house, the something house. Gosh, I should I should write this stuff down. I keep forgetting <laughs> what it was called. This is the house that he said that I went to with my father. Of course, we'd just seen that. Ding ding, come on. What? Did I do it too many times? <laughs> We're probably out for a smoke. Wait here. I'll go check. She looks permanently frightened, this girl, doesn't she? What am I... Why are you just staring? What are you supposed to... Oh, okay. I'm supposed to actually turn around and look at things. Oh, look, there you go. That's that's my dad and uh, Mr. Flowers. The Delphi House Founders and Staff... Oh, we've got more pictures. There's the nurse. Okay, am I missing something here? Oh, just, just needed to have a good look around, that's all. What the hell? He had like a mask with antlers on. And a white cloak, that looked like a cult. A cult had been caught. Do I answer the phone? Yeah, go on, answer the phone. No one else is going to. her. Ask what the hell you're doing. Oh, I find. If you don't look, you'll never know. Find Elodie Carter. See for yourself. Okay, she dealt with that remarkably calmly. I'll give her that credit. Find Elodie Carter. Okay, well she was looking at the door. Let's let's go check that out. What about the detective or the inspector or whatever whatever his title was? He's disappeared. That's it. It's the last we'll ever see from him. Find a symbol carved in his chest in a minute, I'm sure. Okay, what do we got? We got uh, a desk. Uh, was that a radio? Oh, but some files. Yeah, let's go for the files. It's a bit hard to see what's going on. It's very dark. All right, well we're not getting in there any anytime soon. Uh, maybe the key for it is in the desk. Yes. So yeah, a mixture of swiping and selecting, but you actually select by releasing the touchpad once you're hovering over something. Let's have a read of what this says. Dear Mr. and Mrs. Johnson, it's with great sadness that we extend out condolences something, 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 something. 
didn't have time to read it. Oh, here we go. To you and your family, uh, Tiara was... Tiara was suck. Such a delightful girl. Even at the end, she faced her challenges head on, and despite her circumstances, which were never less than difficult, she remained true to herself until the last. Somebody's... Oh, hang on a minute. The E. True, and, and please find, along with this letter, her possessions, which... And it stops. But he kept missing the letter E a couple of times. Strange. Not every time. Oh, this was the first attempt. True to herself until the last, please find along this letter her possessions, which we are happy to return. Please fly, find enclosed multiple clothes, items, ashtray, what? Box of jewelry, wall hangings, crazy pictures. Crazy pictures. Withhold or burn. Okay. I'd like to know what the crazy pictures are. Okay. Maybe there's a key in one of these drawers. Yeah, go on. Pull it out. Pull it open. Come on, Erica. Corker on way. Sec, sec, sec resource? What have I got to do with this? Ooh, okay, yeah, let's do that whole... Yeah, I always wanted to do this in real life. Oh, this is really annoyingly difficult with the controller, but I'm getting there. That says... Is that Yo... Yoha? And then a number? I think. How much more of this do I have to uncover? I can kind of see it. Is there more? Oh my god. This isn't at all irritating. Is it going to reveal anything to me here? Or... or Or have I kind of found it all? 105 something something. I, I can't tell if I'm actually wasting... Oh, alright. Thankfully, the game knew I was taking too long. <laughs> uh, one more. One more draw. Just one more draw, dude. Hey, hey. As predicted. Okay, this must be the key for that. The room we couldn't get into in the first place. And we're looking for something to do with Alady Carter. Do I want to know what... Oh, I'm not going to turn the radio on. People will know I'm in here. Maybe that's the trap, you know? That could be one of the things that you fail. You fail to find this information if you turn the radio on, maybe. I don't know. Okay, what are we looking for? There we go. There it is. Alady Carter. That's the one. That's the picture of the nurse that I uncovered in my failed test. Record of termination. Committed to impatient... Is that care? Inpatient care, sorry. Not impatient. <laughs> she was just fed up. Couldn't wait. <laughs> uh, okay. So she's been admitted to a mental hospital. Akal Jahar. Ah, Akal Jahar. That's the name. That's the name of the person whose hand we found. <laughs> what the hell are you doing here? I'm sorry. Go to my office. 
Let me run. All right. <laughs> a waste of time. I see you found someone. I guess I should have just stayed put. The man at the desk or in trouble. Oh, yeah, let's go with in trouble. Because I don't know if we should trust this guy, but we might as well start. He's in the office. Why? What happened? I told you to stay put. Uh, masked girls. Were they girls? Or my or mother's file? Yeah, mother's file. File. Oh, my mother. It said she was committed here as a patient. That doesn't sound right. Mr. Flowers would know. He was a boss, after all. You could ask him. Uh, was Ali, was Ali Lee Carter my mother then? What about this phone call? A woman rang here. She she knew who I was. Oh yeah. Hey, hey, off the phone. Gotta go. Mr. Steinbeck, Sergeant Blake is here on police business. As is Chief Inspector Cook. Sir. We need to talk. There's been a development. Of course. Dr. Ballard, would you mind showing Miss Mason to her room, please? Of course. Come on. I'll show you the way. All very intriguing, isn't it? Showing me to my room. I mean, nothing good is going to happen here. I don't remember I you. I worked with your father. I used to look after you when you were little. Uh, I remember you ran around the basement looking for ghosts. You knew my parents? Of course. Your dad taught me everything I know. And your mum, she was incredible. A brilliant nurse, so smart. It's funny. Anyway, this is you. You might recognize it. So the woman, I oh, see, the woman who sent me the hand. The night manager will be downstairs if you need anything. Mr. Steinbeck. Okay, the night manager. <laughs> she just looks permanently bewildered, doesn't she? Um, yeah, so the woman who sent me the, the hand sent me the hand of the psychiatrist and the psychiatrist, this, this guy Akal Jahar, I assume that's what he was, he, he committed my mother, I think, who was Aladi Carter, to a mental home. Hmm, okay, I think I'm getting this, I, I, please correct me if I'm wrong, but I will find out the hard, oh, this is another memory. in the case what's in the case come on come on lift it lift it lift it I'm getting impatient records I suppose they are and the game's chosen this one for us didn't have a choice what's it called something Rhea Gloria maybe for Delphi or Aria a wind Tory what's a wind Tory is that a story in the winter
Okay, I don't like this. The sinister music. Oh, what's this? I'm wiping away the... Is this wiping away dust? Oh, dear lord. Okay, that's my name carved into the desk. Yeah. Is there anything else there? Like Erica Run or something like that. It freak me out. Oh, it's her. Oh, right. Little Erica wrote this in the desk. <laughs> Look under the bed. Uncle Lucy got you something. It should keep you out of trouble. Okay, I like presents. Oh God, no, it's a scary doll. I don't like it, you can take it back. What is this? Uh yeah, it, is, it, looked, it looked like a... Oh, God. No. 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 These toys should be banned. They're more like... Ho oh, dear Lord. It's head's going to turn, isn't it? It's Chucky. Look at her arm. Well, it's got a symbol on it or something. Oh. Oh, that's just horrible. Thank you. That symbol, yeah, it looks like that half, those two half moons and the line through the middle on the doll's arm there. That did look like uh, what was carved in my dad's chest, in my dad's bird's nest. That's definitely a woman. What do I do this time? Do I look at the face? Can I look at the face? That was a woman, definitely. The way she moved. Do I want to look at myself again? I think we've seen enough, but we'll we'll give it another go. <laughs> oh, what the hell? It's that punch mark. Ooh, okay. Was that her as a little girl? It looked similar, didn't it? It was such a a brief moment, though. I can't be certain. No, 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 no! Not the carpet. It's clean. Uh, okay. Do I, why don't I walk around it? Let's let's walk around it this way then. That isn't that isn't particularly clean. I'd do it again if I were you. I said you can help, but I need to be with you, okay? We talked about this. No oh. Supervision. Got it. So is this a mental home then? Or some something like that? Back off. Yeah, let's get aggressive. Nothing. What? That, that's not the attitude I was expecting after picking back off. Hey, Deathwish. Over here. <sighs> Honestly. Hurry up and die, Hannah. Who's the mean girl? Oh, no, I'm not saying that. Let's talk about music. I don't care about her. What are you playing? This? Ari Fidelphi by, um... Some guy. I don't know. I've never heard of him. Here, take a seat. Let me show you something. So Ari Fidelphi, that was the same... See this bit? It was the record I found. Simple. 
four notes. A double bum bum, I can remember that. I'll do the rest. There you go, I'm a master. There you go. Got to time it right. <laughs> Yeah, go on, give her a tissue. Oh, good God. What are you doing? Here we fucking go. No, 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 no cleaning. No cleaning without Get help. Kirsty. Kirsty, it's okay. She's right. Can you maybe go and get someone? Kirsty likes to be the centre of attention. She's all wide-eyed innocence until she doesn't get her own way, and then it's... <laughs> Stop that! <laughs> Erica, Sergeant Blake's here. Needed in the main office. Come in. Ah, I recognise him. Lucian Flowers? You look just like your mother. Last time we met, you could barely see over the desk. I'm Lucian Flowers. I set this place up with your father. Staff wall portrait meeting... Okay, yeah, I did see him there, so let's mention that I see him. I know who you are. Recognize you from your portrait in the hall. Oh dear, it's quite a statement. If it wasn't for your father, I'd have it replaced. Did you sleep okay? I know the old place can take a bit of getting used to. Uh oh god, right, I've got a whole load of things to, to talk about. I've got so much to say, so many questions. Uh the man at the desk nah, d Oh, what happened? Oh, if Erica doesn't respond in time, the conversation moves on. Okay, uh, I'll I'll try and be quicker then. Or is it too late? We've already moved on. Okay. Uh, talk about nightmares. Yeah, I've been getting a load of them. Yeah. Don't really get much sleep. I have nightmares. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Dr. Ballard heads up our honorology department. She might be able to help you. I hope you don't mind. But... I brought you something. See, I thought we'd be able to ask a few more questions there. <clears throat> I was going to go through them all, but I, maybe I should have chosen something else. Something that would give me more information. Oh, that's the lighter we saw at the very beginning. Well, I would guess it is. Forever yours. So it's Alady. Yeah, Alady. So that's Alady Carter, isn't it? That's that's the name of uh, is that the name of my mother? Because we don't have the same surname. I just kept a hold of it. Hey, sorry about that. Presuming my f my parents were married, I suppose that explained it. Last night's call, Erica. It's extremely likely whoever killed your father killed Mr. Joha. There may be some other victims as well we don't know about. Okay, um, worry? Am I in danger? All we know for sure is that whoever killed Joha has taken an interest in you. Honestly, we don't have much to go on. 
But, unless the flowers has a suggestion, it might help you remember the face of your father's killer. Okay, um, I'm unsure, but I guess, no, actually, yeah, go on, that'd be helpful. Flashes. Nightmares are a silhouette woman with a gun, but that's it. It's like therapy. It was developed by your father, and it might be able to help you with your nightmares. It's completely painless. Oh, come on, let's do it. Yeah, it sounds like fun. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'll do, I'll do it. The images you're going to see are designed to relax you and open up your mind. Oh, this is going to be trippy. The design, regression therapy, to help our patients face their trauma. The first one is just a test. When you see it, just say whatever comes into your head. Okay, uh, we'll go with sky. Sky. That's not what came into my head. I was thinking clouds, but that didn't come up as a choice. If you remember anything important, just write it down. I know revisiting trauma can be difficult, but you're perfectly safe. Let's begin. Or oh, more. Uh, nature? nature? I don't know. I thought I thought of flowers again. That word wasn't there. Oh, God. Uh, Faith? Faith. Uh, farm. I like the way some of these words are sinister, like slaughter was an option. Anger vision. Warmth. Danger. Oh, danger. Danger. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's a mask. <laughs> oh, dear Lord. Um, cut. God, you've got to be really quick. I can't, I can't do this quick enough. Oh God, no, please don't make me open his chest. Oh God, I'm glad that wasn't graphic. <laughs> Nasty, is that a mask? Is that somebody with a mask? Oh yeah. What did you do or what just happened? What just happened? What just happened? You were drawing. You, know, you were drawing the whole time. Oh. Who was that? Oh. I guess that's Mum. Why did you draw her, Erica? Why did you draw your mother? Forever yours, Allodie. What? We have to just keep putting it on and off. Your mother told me this place was her whole life. She worked here, fell in love here, had you here. Later, she died here. Oh, right, so she's dead. Dr. Ballard suggested that I show you this. Putting yourself through that was incredible. Certificate of death. <clears throat> Allodie Erica Mason. Okay, well, we know where my name's come from. And Allodie Carter was her. Okay, so Carter was her, uh, her maiden name. 
Uh, married to Peter Mason, yeah. Female Caucasian, 6th of August. So she died on the 6th of August. Delphi House, that's the name of this place. Okay, is that all we can glean from this? Do we need any more? It takes time. Uh, determined. Yes, let's go. Let's remain determined. Let's keep this positive. You need to rest. Clear your mind. We can try again another time. Come on. There's something I want to show you. We'll need this. Oh, okay. I have to <laughs> interact. That's a choice, you know. Allardee Mason, in memory, wife, mother, and dearest friend of Delphi House, I think it says. Oh, it, you can actually... <laughs> it can make it a lot cleaner. What does it say? It lies not in our power to love or hate... For willingness is overruled by fate. When two are stripped, long ere the course begin, we wish that one should... What's that bottom word say? Something the other win. I can't, I can't read that. Very hard to do with this touchpad. Definitely, the, the if you're going to play this, get the smartphone app. <laughs> I might try that in part two. Yep. Your father had the oleander planted in your mother's memory. They were her favorite. They've always brought us luck. Oh, yeah, that's the angry girl. Sometimes the girls have difficult days. But some of us like to keep it buried deep down inside. Anna, I didn't think you'd be up. This is Erica Mason. She'll be staying with us for a while. Didn't I bleed all over you this morning? I'm taking these to Doc Ballard. We're making perfume. Do you want to come? Fuck uh. <laughs> off! I thought that was Erica's answer. Actually, they're about to serve lunch. It's quite a spread. Why don't you go and grab yourself a bite and maybe meet some of the other girls? Sure. Who doesn't love a good old soggy sandwich in the company of strangers? Okay, so choices are make perfume or check on Toby. I should probably check on her. She doesn't look like... Maybe I should check on Toby. No worries. I guess I'll catch you around. Yeah, and considering the kind of... If you make perfume regularly, I don't want to... Very good of you to go to her. Projectile vomit she blood out of my nose. Quite manipulative. Just be careful. That's all. Maybe she's not very good at making perfume. That's what maybe that's what the nosebleed was all about. What are you doing? Diffuse the situation. I just came to see if you were okay. You want to be friends? Is that it? It's lunchtime. Go and eat with the good girls. Go eat with the good girls? Uh, confront. Yeah, I'm going to confront her. Come on. You're a tourist. This place has secrets. You need to be careful or you're going to get hurt. Go on, ask her questions. Don't back down. These are secrets. Oh, I see. You're looking for adventure. Is that it? Fine. Come with me. Oh, how exciting. I think we're stepping up a gear. It's been quite a slow start to set the background of the story. But it looks like we're about to find out something more interesting. 
I mean, the story's intriguing. Cozy, huh? Yeah. Little something I prepared earlier. Uh, decline, question, or challenge? What's challenge? Just, just, just question it. What is it? Deadly poison. Oh, I'll have some then. Jesus. It'll put hairs in your chest. Go on, have a drink. Refusal drink. Yeah, go on, have a, have a swig. Is it <laughs> someone send you that guy's hand in a box? Answer. Hiding out. Deflect. Deflect. No. Uh, give her an answer. Yes. Wasn't your dad some sort of genius doctor? Um. Answer. Yes. What about your mum? I heard she died here. Just tell, just tell the truth. She might be a useful ally later. Yeah, I guess so. Open it. I've got no reason not to trust her. Got no reason to trust her either. But you know, somebody like her might be good in a fight. <laughs> we might need her. What is this? This oh god, this looks like a picture. Yeah, look, those white robes and the, the antler masks. That's what we saw in the corridor earlier on at the hotel reception. Engage or dismiss? Yeah, come on, let's engage. We want the truth. How did you see it? It wasn't me. The girl who drew it, she died. She used to have these weird dreams. Easy now, Erica. Pink flowers falling from the sky. It's your nosebleeds. Oh. Fits. Nosebleeds. Okay. Nosebleeds. Yeah, I can. I didn't listen. Everybody thought she was crazy. After she died, I... I found that... Mm -hmm. Okay. <sighs> what is it? I don't... Do you see that? Oh, is that a goat? <laughs> it's a goat. Look at that. A butterfly above, or is that something like a butterfly above a goat? What's, what do I do? I push, press a button. Oh, that's a button. I couldn't make out what that was. They had fits, seizures. Conspiracy? You think they're doing something like that here? I know how it sounds, but check this out. Got it. I'm getting pissed. There's something behind there. A tunnel or something. You know how Granddaddy Flowers made his money? <laughs> By trading futures. <laughs> she she's not well. Oh. <laughs> yeah, the vision's getting more and more blurry. Oh, what? Oh, you brushed. Did you brush the hair away? Okay, yeah, fine. Are you tired? Are 
Oh, hang on a minute. Dreams of pink petals. On come the nosebleeds then. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Oh god, that's that's the yeah. That's a rabbit and a deer. But what is that? Was that a butterfly? God. Happened to the best of us, waking up in the middle of a field, not knowing what happened the night before. We've all been there, you know. Good lord. Drag to explore. Okay. Uh huh. I hope that's my foot. It's not like another present from that woman. And look what the cat dragged in. Where the hell have you been? I've been looking everywhere. You've got mail. Looks expensive. So pretty. Open it. All right. It's weird seeing things open like that, you know, without any hands in the way. It's like when we saw that doll and you lifted up the sleeve, it just looked creepy. Oh, God, great, another one. These Fantastic. I mean, be careful. Actually, no, she's right. Be careful. Oh, it's gone up with. Is that another present? Oh, for God's sake. Oh. Uh, Hannah? Hannah. Oh, God, she's having a seizure. Give us space. What happened? That's been cut off somebody, hasn't it? That's the... The tattoo. Oh, we saw that on the guy at the... The hotel reception. Yeah, him. God, I mean, how many more body parts can this girl get sent by mail? We're still trying to get a description of the sender. Here, take a look at this. That's Carl Steinbeck's place, the night manager. How do we take a look at... Oh, yeah, all right, I'm looking at him. I've got to look at the picture. I'm trying, I'm trying. What are you looking at? Nothing. Evidence on the left. I can't do anything here. Okay. Drag to explore. I mean, I'm, I am trying, but there's nothing to look at. Apart from that, that man. <laughs> Mr. Flowers. He's missing. Why that symbol? Yes, I want to know more about it. Symbol tattooed in his arm. It used to be on a sign out front. It's from the Temple of Apollo at Delphi in Greece. Oh. Their motto was, know thyself. No doubt thought it would be good for us too. After he died, we took the signs down, but Carl's tattoo remained. Know thyself. Is the skin his? I... Mm. Was it his? The skin? No, it's not official. But it's the same tattoo. And then there's this. Why send the doll? Well, I guess because... Is it the same doll? Oh god, I think it is. It was a gift from Lucian. Uh, it was a gift from Lucian. He gave it to me before my father died. 
Erica used to spend so much time here, there weren't any other children. I always tried to smuggle her some toys or a treat. This is one of many. We're gonna have to go back to your flat. I need you to have a look around. Make sure there's nothing else missing. You can grab some extra clothes, whatever else you need. Looks like you might be here for a while. Fair enough. I uh, have to check myself. I'm performing my own investigation here. Great, the door was already jimmed. Jimmied. Looks like there's plenty to have a look around. Let me check this this one first. The book, can I? Yep. <clears throat> oh, these look familiar. Yep, there it is again. Oh, that's the woman that we we tried to help. Stay there. A bad smell means bad things. Police, open the door, or the door will be forced open. The door is about to be forced open. Oh, what, what can I do? Oh, there was a memory there. Yes, yeah, the woman I was going to help. All right, offered to help. Follow or obey. I'll oh, just follow. Come on. We're going to be naughty. <laughs> Good idea or a bad idea? It might save his life. It might end ours. But I'm curious. There's a symbol on the wall. That, oh, recognize that, anyone? Oh, yeah. She was definitely involved. Or somebody that's been in here since was. Actually, that could be more likely. She's got a microscope on the table behind her there. And what, are, what is all this hanging stuff? What is it all? Oh, I see. Look, we can check things out. Do I want to go into the door? Do I want to check the the cooker? Hey, let's check the fridge. Is that a fridge? What are all these things hanging? Is it is it body parts? Are these pieces of people? More skin grafts? Yeah, look in the fridge. There's bound to be something hideous in there. Come on. Oh god. Okay, not so bad. Oh no, there's jars with things in them. Don't. This is a crime scene. Carl Steinbeck is dead. Erica, no. Go back to your apartment. Keep the door shut. Carl Steinbeck. No, I'm gonna go and see. I wanna see this. Oh dear lord. Don't look, don't look. Don't why not? We might learn something. You're safe. Oh great. More music. 
So Carl Steinbeck is dead. I'm trying to remember who he was now. <laughs> oh, there's so much to remember. Wow. Okay, I'm going to end the episode here. And you're going to have to find out what Come Here With Me Now leads to in the next part. Uh, and it's just going to take a break and then I'm going to start recording the next part of it. Um, I'll, I'll put it up soon. Guys, thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed that. It was something a bit different. And, uh, well, yeah. Let me know what you think in the comments below. What do you think going? What do you think's going on here? If you do know, of course, plot, try not to spoil it for everybody else. But uh, if you if you're not sure, you're not you've not seen it, then theorize. Let's have a chat. Thanks very much for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one. All the best and good night. <laughs>